Hey, what's up? What's up guys, how you doing? Today we're talking about two fragrances that are really fun to wear, okay? They get a lot of compliments, it's inexpensive, I love them. So the two that I'm talking about today is, because uh, you can see from the title, of course. Um, Azaro Chrome Sport and Nautica Voyage, okay? Azaro Chrome Sport and Nautica Voyage, you can see from the title. So this is a battle right here, okay? Which one should you get? Which one's better, okay? The, the first thing I wanna talk about is these are both aquatic scents. They both have a watery nature to them. This one being, and they both have a green type of smell, but the greenness is different. So, Azara Chrome Sport, dubbed the popular guy's scent in my introduction. This is when I first made a video about it. Now, you can see how much I've used quite a bit. Maybe it's the same as last time, I'm not sure, but I've used quite a bit, I've been wearing it. So this one, everyone says it smells like Versace Eau Fresh. To me, it smells like um, a fresher, stronger version of Mont, Mont Blanc Starwalker, um, but it's better. It's like not better, but it's um, it's like it's it's fresh. It's got this freshly cut grass smell. It has a very nice citrus, uh, Amalfi lemon. It's like a lemons, two different types of lemons in it, and a bitter orange. But what I smell is that freshly cut grass, aquatic scent to it, very nice aquatic scent to it, and the um, the citrus is the orange, the bitter orange, and the lemon mixed together, making it like a a nice mishmash of citrus. And it's projection is really, really good on this one and longevity as well for an aquatic. Just right, just about seven to eight hours, okay, you get, but the projection is strong, okay? So this one, if you wear this, you're gonna get, you're gonna get noticed. Kinda reminds me of, um, well, no. This one smells like um, Versace Eau Fresh, but it has like a, uh, that has that, it reminds me of CH Men, but not in the way that you're thinking, not in the sweetness way. There's like a grassy note in there that this sort of has. It has that gra like a freshly cut grass smell that I really enjoy that's in this. And it gives it this, um, this freshly cut grass green smell and the um, lemon and the watery aquatic notes all mixed in together, giving it this really cool, youthful, bright, fresh smell. Now, Nautica Voyage, Nautica Voyage, it's great. This one has like a, um, a salty vibe in there as well. It's got a nice apple. So it, this one is sweeter. It has a sweeter note to it. It has the um, aquatic note to it. It has a green note, more like a wet dew green, but like a green, think of like a, it rains on the grass and the grass is wet, but it's not grass. It rains on a leafy bush and it's wet. Kind of has that nice morning dewy f smell to it with a little bit of salt. With a little bit of with a little bit of saltiness in there in the background because it has an oceanic vibe to it, but not salty in the way that you get from uh, Invictus or uh, um, or um, Aqua Bulgari Aqua. Not that type of saltiness. More of it's just a light saltiness, very very easy and not salty at all. But you can kind of tell it's oceanic and not like a lake or not like just wet grass. And the apple in here is really, really good. So the, this, these are both really inexpensive, but really, really high on the complimenting factor, really, really high on the versatility. Really high, this one is. So I get a lot of compliments this, with this one. People really enjoy smelling it. So if you're in high school, you really wanna pick this one up, especially if you're, if you're in high school, because this one is um, a little bit of an older scent now. I think it was 2000, don't, 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 don't quote me on it. I don't know the date. It's a, it's a little bit of an, uh, not old, but around the 2000s. And so is this one, around the same time zone. Um, however, for you in high school right now, people really won't be wearing this any as much unless their older brother gave it to them after they didn't finish the bottle. But most likely they finished the bottle and no one in your school has smelled this at all. See that blue liquid? Perfect, perfect, perfect. Both of these are perfect scents. Uh, this one, and because of the performance, you can wear them all year long. Maybe if it's really cold in your area, you may not want to, but it, it, it will smell like you can still smell it in the very, very, very cold. 
all year long you can wear these because the performance is there uh, which one performs better i would say this one projects a little bit more and this one lasts a little bit longer like i can smell this the next day light especially on my clothes this one um i can smell the next day but not as much it kind of pulls a little bit disappearing at towards the end of the day but yeah this isn't citrus this is apple this is citrus so yeah <clears throat> this is this is apple and this is citrus this is has a little bit of salt in it and this is straight up cut grass so which one is which one is better i say universally this one is um better just because it's easier to easier to wear and um this one might just be like too much citrus for you but not really because it's not too much citrus but this one has like a um how can i put it a um it's um the way the apple you know apple just as a note apple has this, this sweetness to it that a lot of people like this one has the citrus and citrus can be People can mistake it to be a little bit too sporty, but I get a lot of compliments with this and my wife likes this one, actually likes this one more. Uh, you personally may like this one more too. So if I was to go on on, a, on price only, this one is less expensive right now. So I would get this one first, believe it or not. Oh, I'm like right about to say this one, but I would get this one first only because it has like a, like a newer type of a smell. A more uh, and more projection even though this one lasts a little bit longer the projection here is a bit sharper and for summertime is a bit is, is they're both great for summertime um, but if I was you I would just get both I would I would not get one or the other because you would miss out on this one and if you get this one you would miss out on this one so yeah it's basically a tie but for me for my preference I would get this one just because it's a more unique scent yeah it's more unique this one a lot of people know about this have worn this a lot not like a voyage people have worn not like a voyage a lot and um azaro sport or azaro chrome sport not not worn as much okay but like i said if you're in school you should get either either you should get both of these because they're easy to wear they're gonna get you a lot of compliments. And the thing about it is that the price, uh, the price is perfect because you can get both of them. They're both like 20 bucks. You could probably get a smaller size of this and a smaller size of this. Uh, this is being maybe 3.4 ounce right here. Um, but I will say, I will say the bottle, this bottle is better. Okay, this bottle is better. And then the Apple Note, is um, is also unique because there's not many smells that smell exactly like Nautica Voyage. You don't hear people say, oh, this smells like Nautica Voyage. Oh, this smells like Nautica Voyage. The same, but this one you can say, oh, this kind of smells like Invictus Aqua 2016. You might get something like that. No, this might smell like, like Mont Blanc Star Walker. No, this smells like Versace or Fresh. So this one as well, it, it having that modern thing, but no, I'm Broxen. It's more of a citrus based sports scent. This one's that beautiful apple. So yeah, Nautica Voyage. Um, you know what, hold up. Let me try and find out exactly what year it is because instead of you guys looking up, if you guys are dealing with the uh, coronavirus, please, please stay safe out there. Be sensible. Come on. All right, let's see Nautica Voyage, all right? Yeah, it just, um, want you guys to know the actual date it came out so you have a gauge of time here and which one's older which one's not so not a good voyage right it came out let's see maybe so not a good voyage came out in 2006 okay and Zaro Chrome Sport came out so 
So Zara Chrome Sport came out in 2010, right? So yeah, I was right. Zara Chrome Sport's newer. It smells newer as well. It has like a, a newer vibe to it. Um, yeah, about four year difference, right? So what you're getting in Nautica Voyage, what you're getting in Nautica Voyage is the cedar and apple and some amber. So it's giving it, giving it good sweetness. And what you're getting in Nautica, Vo in, um, in Nautica Voyage. So what you're getting in um, Zara Chrome Sport is yeah, you get, yeah, I was missing the ginger. You're getting ginger, lemon, uh, I believe that's uh, grapefruit. So that's what that is. Grapefruit, uh, grassy notes, bergamot, and also cedar. So they both, and bitter orange and amber. So they both have some similar notes being the cedar, the amber, and the musk, and the, uh, I believe the bergamot too. I don't think, uh, uh, hold on a second. So yeah, the main thing being, okay, between these two scents is that um, Nautica Voyage has zero, I'm telling you, it has zero citrus. So if you say, ah, I don't want any citrus, 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 it just, it's too much. I have scents, I have a citrus scent, I don't want that. What I want is an aquatic with a sweet apple, Nautica Voyage. Don't even get, don't even get this one. Don't even forget about 2006 and what I said. If you want a sweet, a sweet scent that's unique, get Nautica Voyage because Nautica Voyage has a beautiful apple, great performance, and the price is just right. It's a little bit more expensive than that. It's like 20 bucks or 23 bucks or $25. I would pay, I'd pay a lot more for this, but yeah, though I'm not gonna say that in Nautica Voyage, it makes the price high, but it, it's got, it's coming, it's in a beautiful bottle. Just sits in your hand like that. Cap, it's got a nice cap to it. The presentation is just really nice in the solid bottle. And if you like citrus, you want, uh, what was that? You want grapefruit, you want lemon, a mouthy lemon, and you want bitter orange, you want that grassy note that I'm talking about, get with this one. This will be your guy. So yeah, but for me, I'm telling you, I get a lot of compliments with both of them. But it, I say this one's a little bit new because it's a little bit newer. I say get this one. But if you're looking, if you don't want to deal with citrus, you don't want to deal with any of that, get a lot of good It's got a beautiful opening, beautiful dry down, and it's it it in fact it's 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 more popular than this one. It's more popular. This is more popular than this. People like this more. Um, but I get a more compliments with this because it's newer, and it's more, it's a more a little bit more rare. Given the price, it's still rare. You're not gonna smell this very often. This one is really great, so yeah. Whichever one you, you, you wanna choose, choose it, but I recommend you get both. All right, peace.